Hey, what is up, YouTube? So, um, some of you might have seen, but a while ago I made a video of what to do if your Nintendo 3DS freezes, and um, that was a horrible video because I filmed it like a really long time ago when I was like first getting started on YouTube and I didn't really know how to edit videos. So I wanted to make an updated version. Um, so if you saw my other um, video, then you will realize that this is not the same DS that was in my last video. The one that was in my last video was actually this one. Um, this is just an old 3DS, like the first version that came out. Um, and this was the one that froze that I did the video, with, my first video with. But um, I just wanted to show it really quickly because um, right here that I'm pulling out is where you put the SD card. And um, I just wanted to say that I would suggest not taking your SD card out if you're gonna like try to fix your DS because I heard that it messes up your DS or whatever. So if you have this type of DS, don't take the little SD card thing out that is right here because I heard it messes up your DS. But I mean, if you really want to, you can because I can't stop you and it's yours. But I mean, th these are expensive so I would just like suggest to not do that. Um, but anyways, if you have this version of a DS, um, or like the smaller version, but that is the same exact thing as this, um, I don't know if it has an SD card, but if it does, it's probably like behind this, like you probably have to unscrew it like right here and take the, like take this cover plate off to get to it because I don't see like anywhere else to get to an SD card or anything because I've looked over it. Um, so anyways, yeah, so... Um, but I just wanted to show this one because I know a lot of people still use this kind. So yeah, but anyways, so um, back to my DS, this one that froze. Um, so what happened was, is that I was at church and I was playing Nintendo Dogs and my game froze like in the middle of it when I was walking one of my dogs and then I didn't know why it froze and I like got freaked out and stuff. So then um, I just turned it off because I was at church so I couldn't really do anything and then when I got home I didn't do anything because I was like mad about it and I knew that I would like throw my DS at the wall or something because I was like really pissed about it. So I didn't do anything, I just left it off and then like I think like one week later or like a few weeks later, I don't really remember, um, I checked it again to see if it worked and then when I first tur um, turned it on I had the black screen of death and if you don't know what that is it's when your system is turned on so like these power lights will be on but these two screens are both black and like nothing happens and so that happened like temporarily and then I got really freaked out because I never had that happen to me but I heard I had heard about it on YouTube so I got really freaked out and I was like I don't know what to do so then um I just turned it off again and then um and then I think like I don't, I think like I waited like a week after that and then I tried to do it again and then thankfully the black screen of death went away and then so I turned it back on but like this, like where the game thing is right there, um, it wasn't loading so I was like, I was like crap, I didn't know what to do again and then so I tried to like, I clicked on a, another random app, like I think I clicked on my, um, on my me app like this app or something or like this app I don't know like one of those apps and then um it like it opened but then it froze again so then after that like I started looking stuff up because I didn't know like what to do and I didn't want to pay to like get it fixed so then um I like saw this video on YouTube and then so basically um what it said to do was go to settings and then um you open it obviously <laughs> and then um, after it loads, I'll show you. Okay, and then you go to other settings, and then you basically just scroll until you see um, system update, and then you click system update, and then you just click OK, and then it will update your system for you. And then I tried that, and then thankfully it worked, because when I was researching, I saw that, um, that it meant that, or it might mean that you needed to update your system. So I tried it, and it worked, so yeah. So, um, so that's pretty much it and then I also wanted to make this video because um, I was just showing that it could also work on the newer um, version of the DS as well. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So I hope that this video was helpful to you um, and I will put the same video about 
or actually no, I'll just probably find a different video about the black screen of death. So if you need to fix it, because I don't really know how to fix the black screen of death. So I will just link a video in the description of this video so that it, it could help you if you're having problems with the black screen of death. Because I don't know, mine just went away by itself. So yeah, I can't really help with that. So I'm sorry, I apologize. But anyways, yeah, so that's pretty much it. And I hope that um, this you like this video better because I think it was better than my last video. So, um, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Bye.